Hey everyone, Caffeine Man here, and I have another top 10 video for you guys today. I have done numerous top 10 videos, and you guys really, really seem to like them. And I am trying to get you guys at least one top 10 video a month because you guys like them so much. And this month's top 10 list is going to be the top 10 C4 yellow cans coming right up. Hello again, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today. And if you want to stay informed on all things caffeine related, feel free to hit the subscribe button. I post new videos every Tuesday night and one on the weekends. And in today's video, we're going to be doing the top 10 C4 energy drinks. As I mentioned already, I have done numerous top 10 videos, top 20 videos, top five videos. And if you want to check any of those out, you can check out my channel. I actually made a playlist and in that playlist, I have all the top 10 top videos, all the ranking videos, rating and ranking videos that I've done. You're gonna see that I tasted out and ranked every single G Fuel flavor. I also did every single Monster Ultra, also did all the rain drinks, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So if you like top lists, I do plan to continue to grow that playlist. And today I'm adding C4 to that playlist. As for this C4 playlist, it is gonna be the yellow cans, which are the pre-workout cans. If I were to add the C4 Smart Energy, they, they would just all be at the top of the list because I absolutely love the C4 Smart Energies. So I'll probably have to save that for another time. And that is actually a different category altogether anyway. It is part of the nootropic line, which are for energy and focus, concentration, and things like that. Whereas these yellow cans are used for pre-workout primarily. Now, before I begin, I do just want to let you know that this is actually going to be my personal list. And what exactly do I mean by that? Why am I prefacing that? Well, because my Caffeine Man rating chart is based on flavor alone and I try to be as unbiased as possible so even though I may not like certain flavors they're not preferred caffeine man flavors they're still being scored on if they're a good drink or not so there are going to be some that are actually higher on the caffeine man rating chart but they will be slightly lower on my personal list if they even make the personal list and come to think of it uh, the caffeine man rating chart when I actually did my first review on C4 I reviewed the first nine energy drinks that C4 came out with that was actually bad Back in 2019, it was before I even had the Caffeine Man rating chart. That's how long ago it was. My goodness. That, I mean, it seems like yesterday, but 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 then at the same time, it seems like so long ago. I mean, if you guys watch the video, you'll see, see like how different the videos were back then compared to what they are now. And, and even though it seems like yesterday, uh, it was that three years, 365, that's like, that's like a thousand yesterdays ago. It's, it's, it's a lot of yesterdays. And that, that actually, that sounds like the name of a movie. Don't you think that sounds like a name of a movie? A thousand yesterdays. I don't know what it is. I've been relating things to like music and movies lately. And uh, and I mean, it sounds like it would be like a time travel movie or some kind of like sci-fi movie. A thousand yesterdays. And like they go back and they try and change things on certain days, but then it changes other things. I, I don't know. I should, I should, I should actually, I should probably look it up because it might already be a movie. I, I'm, and usually I I look it up in editing afterwards, but I want to look it up now so I can actually put a screenshot if it is actually a movie. Jump cut. Be right back. And there you go. Yes, it does exist. I am going to put it up there. I want you guys to be able to see it, so I might have to squeeze over this way a little bit. Duck down. But yes, it is an actual movie that is not comfortable. So I might get my shoulder chopped off a little bit so you guys can see it. But but uh, but uh, but yeah, it's 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 definitely not about time travel. It's uh, it's about like World War One. So so definitely uh, not what I was thinking for a movie name. But 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 the strangest thing is that the movie was actually made in 2019, which was the same year I did the C4 review. Who who heebie jeebies. Uh, oh, what, what, what am I doing? What, what, oh, 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 C4 top 10. Let's do this. First off, let's start up with the runners up. Even though this is a top 10 list, there are actually 17 different flavors to choose from. And since the creation of all 17 of those drinks, there have only been two that have been discontinued so far. One of them was the mango lime, which I believe was a limited edition exclusive. And one of the other ones I will be talking about just a little bit later. So which ones did not make the list? Boom, those five right there did not make the list, unfortunately. And for some of them, it was pretty close. I mean, Purple Frost and Twisted Limeade both scored a 9.2 on the Caffeine Man rating chart, meaning this top 10 list is gonna be higher than 9.2. Great drinks. 
So who squeaked in getting that last top 10 spot? Well, this is actually the first example of a drink that scored really, really high on the Caffeine Man rating chart, but this is my personal favorite top 10 list. So even though it scored high, the one coming in at number 10 is gonna be the Lemon Starburst. This scored a 9.6 on the Caffeine Man rating chart. 9.6, really, really high on the Caffeine Man rating chart because it is a really, really great flavor. It is a super strong lemon flavor and that lemon flavor is a candied kind of lemon flavor and it's a Starburst lemon flavor. It tastes just like the Starburst lemon candies just put into a can and it's just an amazing flavor. So if you're someone who likes the yellow Starburst or you like lemon drinks in general, sweet candy lemon drinks, then this one is gonna be for you. But uh, me personally, I'm not usually a huge fan of lemon. So so how come it made the top 10 list? Uh, I might not overly like lemon drinks, like lemonades and stuff, but I do like my candy flavors. So uh, I have had this one a few times since the review because it really is a good lemon candy flavor. Coming in at number nine was actually kind of a shock for me, coming in at number nine, because normally I'm not a fan of these types of flavors. So coming in at number nine is the Arctic Snow Cone. And the reason why it's a shocker is because if you don't watch my channel, you wouldn't know this, but for those of you who do watch my channel, uh, I'm usually not overly into the Arctic flavors, the frost kind of flavors, the glacier kind of flavors. Uh, they tend to be similar to like your white monsters. And I say similar, I'm not saying they taste exactly like the white monsters. I know it's its own thing, but your frost Arctic flavors usually taste similar to like your white monsters. And if you've ever had a glacier frost ice kind of energy drink, you'll know that it does have like a little bit of a citrus feel to it plus that arctic flavor that's really hard to explain you just have to say it's an arctic flavor but even though i'm not a fan of those in general arctic snow cone by c4 it also makes in a nice sweetness to it and i was a really a fan of how sweet it ended up being complement the arctic and citrus kind of flavor i really think it blended everything really nicely together and on the caffeine man rating chart it actually rated a 9.2 just barely beating out that purple frost which was also a 9.2 but when you have them scored the same you have to give preference to one or the other it was the arctic snow cone coming in at number eight when this drink first hit the market there wasn't many drinks out there like this so it was sort of the originator of this type of flavor and it is called sour bash brothers and from the name you might be able to guess what drink they were trying to be similar to and it was really one of the first sweet and sour drinks to really replicate the Sour Patch Candies flavor because Sour Batch Brothers is close to sound like Sour Patch Kids. And they did this before any of the other companies started doing other name brand collabs. But then once companies started doing brand name collabs, a lot of the companies are trying to purchase the rights to get in brand name collabs too. So it wasn't too long after that that Ghost came out with their Sour Patch Kids. And although they came out with a red berry and a blue raspberry, the C4 Sour Bash Brothers is actually a lime flavor. So if you're looking for a sweet and sour lime, no one else is making it. You can check out the C4 Sour Bash Brothers. On the Caffeine Man rating chart, I rated this a 9.4. So why isn't it higher up on the list? Well, once again, it's a personal list and uh, sour drinks usually aren't my thing, but candy drinks are. So uh, I like the sweet and sour flavor. So number eight, Sour Bash Brothers, it's a good sweet and sour lime. And coming in at number seven is gonna be the Starburst Orange flavor. Once again, C4 did an amazing job with their Starburst line. If you haven't seen my review on it yet, I'm gonna put it up there so you guys can go and check it out. And it wasn't just me who gave it a great review. A lot of other people said that the Starburst was one of the top energy drinks from C4. And they came out with four different Starburst flavors, all of them really, really good. And the orange one actually rated a 9.3 on the Caffeine Man rating chart. So it wasn't as high as the lemon, but it is higher on the list because I do like orange just a little bit more than my lemon flavors. Therefore, number seven, Starburst Orange. Coming in at number six, also rated at a 9.3, and that's the Frozen Bombsicle. Now, when I first tried this drink, I had not had many red, white, and blue flavors. Whether they're called red, white, and blue, Rocket Pop, Freedom Pop, basically, you know, that ice cream popsicle thing. I'll put a picture there in case you don't know what I'm talking about, but, but those are your Rocket Pop kind of flavors. They're red, white, and blue flavors. I had not had any at all on my channel. This was the very first one, and I didn't know, uh, even from the name Frozen Bombsicle, that it was supposed to be a Rocket Pop flavor. 
So I reviewed it not even knowing what it was. I actually related it closer to a blue Raz drink with a little bit of that frozen Arctic kind of flavor that you get in drinks with, with some other flavors mixed in there. So overall, for not knowing exactly what it was, I actually got pretty close to what it was supposed to be. I, I just missed out on the red, which was the other flavor that was in there. But 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 that was way back in 2019. I had really just kind of started my channel and C4 actually decided to sponsor that video. It was the first sponsored video I had ever done. So thank you to C4 for offering me that sponsored video. And then who knew several years later, I would actually get an actual sponsorship with them. And that was because I approached them because even after I did those first nine drinks in that first review, I loved almost every single drink after that. And I said, man, it would be great to be sponsored by them. And, and I guess you have to ask because you don't get if you don't ask. So I asked them and they said, sure, we love your content. Why not sponsor you? So yes, this is a sponsored video. But as I said earlier, I've been ranking drinks like Red Bull, Monster, G Fuel and so forth. So it was about time I did a C4 video. And now we are actually at the halfway point. This is the time that I tell you not only am I sponsored by C4, but I tell you where you can actually purchase them. You can actually easily find these at your local supplement store. That's right. Uh, they are pre-workout, so they are actually at your local supplement stores. But I've also seen them in convenience stores and gas stations. So they've really, really been expanding out. It is difficult to get into convenience stores and gas stations, but they are doing it. So, so congratulations to C4 for constantly expanding with the great drinks that you guys have. But if you are looking to pick them up online because there are so many flavors that you love and you want to purchase them, in bulk you can look down below i will have a link in a pinned comment as well as the description box that will take you to the c4 amazon page as we all know amazon has great prices on just about everything so if you use that link down below i will get credit for that sale and it helps out the channel now they might not have the lowest price because someplace else that has prices i like to give you guys options is campus protein they sometimes have a buy one get one 50 off sale on the c4 and they have been known to have on their big sales they usually have like three or four big sales a year buy one get one free on c4 so it's always good to check out campus protein to see what sales they have and even if they don't have a sale on c4 you can still save 10 percent off with coupon code caffeine man 10. coming in at number five is gonna be the midnight cherry this one also scored a 9.3 so there are definitely several 9.3s that are actually rating pretty high on my top 10 list but this is definitely one of my top cherry flavors and you might not know that because i haven't done my top 10 cherry flavors yet but i do plan on doing it i haven't gotten to the cherries yet there are a lot of flavors to go over so i do hope to get you that video soon and once i do you can expect to see this one pretty high up there because i think that it is a great cherry flavor it's only number five out of the C4 energy drink, but it is definitely pretty high for one of my top 10, maybe even one of my top five cherries. But to see where it does actually fall on that list, you'll have to patiently wait until I get to that video. I'm trying to do one top 10 list a month for you guys. Coming in at number four, if you guys like cherry flavors, what do you guys think about cherry lime flavors? Because C4 also has a great cherry lime. It is called Cherry Limeade. Switch. Not exactly sure why I'm showing you all the cans because all the cans look exactly the same. It's just what I do. Maybe I'll jump cut it out to save two seconds per can, save myself 20 seconds. Plus I'm putting a picture of it right here. I don't know, it's just the format I do. If you don't like it, let me know in the comments down below. But yes, this cherry limeade is a great flavor. There've been a decent amount of cherry limes out there. I actually rated this cherry lime a 9.4, so it is higher than those 9.3s, obviously. But even though there are a lot of cherry limes out there i definitely think this is solid competition and i should probably do a cherry lime top 10 too so 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 many top 10 lists to do so little time you guys should share this channel with all your friends and family i never say that in my videos i always say feel free to subscribe i never tell you guys to like the videos i never tell you guys to share the videos but really it would be great to get the name out about caffeine man so once again a lot of people forget to do it but if you know someone who's interested in energy drinks definitely be sure to share this video or any of the videos videos that they might like if they're a monster person send my monster ones not 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 my not that one send them a send them a better monster video that i did and so forth for all the companies where was i i'm not here i'm going over there
All right, guys, we have made it. That's right, the top three. And you guys know what I like to do when it comes to the top three. We like to play a little game called Can You Guess What the Top Three Caffeine Man Rated Flavors Are? Oh, leave me a comment down below if you think you know. Coming in at number three, this, this, this is actually, this is a shame because this drink has, it has it's been discontinued. And I don't know why it's been discontinued. It's my number three C4 flavor. And I know other people like this flavored drink they told me so in my comments and in person so so i get i'm guessing my best guess is maybe it didn't sell as well as some of the other c4 flavors but that's probably because people didn't know how delicious it was they didn't give it a shot they they, they stuck with their favorites and didn't give the cotton candy a shot no matter how much i promoted the cotton candy so 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 my number three favorite if i didn't give it away did i did i actually just give it away when, when i said flavors i don't know i can't remember what i said but it is the cotton candy flavor yes uh, uh i guess other people like other drinks besides cotton candy or they they just like i said they like their best flavors they didn't give cotton candy a shot but for some reason or another uh c4 didn't listen to me either and they decided to cancel discontinue discontinue that cotton candy uh maybe they plan on bringing it back but 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 you know there's a little part in the back of my brain that hopes maybe they just can't get the the ingredients to do the supply chain or something either way this rated a 9.6 on the caffeine man rating chart it rated way up there and even though i have not done my top 10 cotton candy list yet i plan on doing it and you can expect this one to probably be really really high near the top and, and if you watch any of my cotton candy videos uh, i probably put up the caffeine man rating chart and you'll see on the caffeine man rating chart that this is the top of my list so so for those of you who are watching this video when you get to my top 10 cotton candy video most likely this is going to be number one unless someone releases a cotton candy before then and actually later on this week uh actually right after i record this video i'll be recording the ninja cotton candy and we'll see how competitive that is to this one this video is going to be way too long because uh, i'm talking way too much so number three C4 cotton candy, sorry you can't have it, it's been discontinued, but you should have got in on it sooner. Coming in at number two, man, this was this was heavily debated. And who was it debated by? Just just me in my head, really, because I couldn't figure out who was gonna be number two and who was gonna be number one. And the reason why it would cause such a big debate is because this drink actually rated a 9.75 on the Caffeine Man rating chart. And it is currently the highest rated C4 flavor out of all the C4 flavors for the yellow can. So how could it be my number two choice? Well, it's hard to say it, but the number two is gonna be the Skittles flavor. That's right. Not only did they do a Starburst collab, but they also did a collab with Skittles and they did an amazing job with it. And, and part of the reason why it's heavily debated is because online in my comments, there were several people that were pretty vehement about it not being tasted like Skittles. And, and there was a, there was, I would say a small percentage. It wasn't just one or two people. It was a small percentage that, that just didn't think that it tasted like Skittles. And, and I watched other reviews online, but a majority of the people that did the reviews on Skittles said it was amazing amazing and that it tasted like Skittles, but there was a small percentage of the population that didn't think it tasted like that. But me personally, I thought it tasted like Skittles in a can. If you want to see my review, I did a review on it. Not only did I do a review, put the review away. I actually did a video doing a battle of the Skittles. So all those drinks there, if they're pictured there, I forget what the thumbnail looks like, but I did a battle of the Skittles. Yeah, yeah, I put, I did do it. Never mind. So, so, the, so they're on there. There are other flavors that basically these companies want to replicate the Skittles flavor because it's a great flavor but only one company was able to put the Skittles name on there. And I do a breakdown to let you know which one of those flavors tastes like Skittles in case you like other Skittles flavors. But for me, this was the top Skittles flavor. They had every right to put their name on it and it tastes like liquid Skittles in a can. If you have not tried it out, I encourage you to try it out. Go to the store right now, pick one up, then leave me a comment down below if you agree. It tastes like Skittles in a can, then go to the C4 Amazon page and buy a whole case of it. So if Skittles was number two and rated the top on the list, what in the world was number one? I know some of you guys know it because you keep track of the Caffeine Man rating chart. And this drink rated a 9.7 on the Caffeine Man rating chart, just slightly below the Skittles. But the reason why it holds the number one spot is based on what flavor it is. 
and it is the starburst cherry flavor yes starburst cherry amazing amazing flavor and i liked it just a little bit more than the skittles red starburst are my favorite out of all the starburst and the yellow and the orange as you know not as good and i am actually the person that buys the flavor reds that's right they came out with flavor reds just so that you could get the reds and the pinks which are some of the people's favorite ones you don't have to worry about getting the lemon and the orange so so yes cherry starburst my favorite starburst flavor personally and why am i even waving this empty can around boom much better get an entire case of this always have it on hand because you know what it's a great flavor i'm not making this stuff up number one why eat sugared candy when sugar is bad for you and you can just drink liquid candy all, all day long yeah they did a great job with it i encourage you all to try out the starburst flavor whatever flavor you like the most be sure to see if they have it in the store i know that they've only been carrying one or two flavors in some of the stores because shelf space is limited but your supplement shop should have all four if you like it buy an entire case you're going to want to get an entire case of your favorite starburst flavor because they really did a great job with all the flavors and of course, the next question is, how long will the cherry starburst stay on top? Oh, you guys know I like my mango drinks. How is mango foxtrot going to do? And they really don't have a mango one. They got the peach mango in the smart energy line, which is one of my favorite favorites so 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 if they're able to get some of that mango flavor and whatever foxtrot flavor is uh they got mango foxtrot coming out according to stack 3d news it should be here in november thank you to stack 3d news for keeping us informed if you're not following them you can follow them on instagram they also have their own website and that is usually where i go to get most of my information about new releases on energy drinks thank you guys so much for joining me today i hope you like this video leave me a comment down below letting me know what your favorite C4 flavor is. I'm guessing most of you are going to say the Skittles or the Starburst because they really did do an amazing job with those flavors. I can't say it enough. So until next time, have yourselves a great day. Poor night. And coming in at number seven is going to be the Starburst Orange. That's not going to work in the right hand. And coming in at number seven is going to be the Starburst Orange flavor. Number five, going to be the Midnight Cherry. Did it again. Not used to be on this side. This wall and this side.